I'm going to real quickly show you how to change the default length of transitions. In this situation, I've got this clip on the right and this clip on the left. And let's say I want to push from one to the other. When I drag the push effect on there, by default, it is one second. And it's going to be that way for every transition. Well, I want all of my transitions to be a bit quicker than that. If I just want to change this one, this one time, well, I can do that in the effects control and just adjust it as I choose. But of course, as soon as I remove it and put another one on, it's going to be back to that original. So to change the default length within effects, so wherever your effects window is, by the way, uh, if you don't see it, go up to windows and make sure you've got effects selected. Click those three little dots there right next to the name and go to set default transition duration. Within that, on the left here, you wanna make sure you've got timeline selected. And then the first one is video transition default duration. And it's set to one second. You can also use frames if you want. So I don't want it quite as long as one second. So I'm gonna go just a little less and go 0.50. I'm gonna hit okay. And now you'll notice when I drag and drop a transition, it's shorter and transitions much quicker, which is exactly what I want. So again, that's gonna change it for all of them. So, so be sure to make note of that. So for example, I'll put this split on here and you see it's at the same length, but that's how you change the default transition.